Alright, here we go, let's get started. So, it's going to be a knot that's going to be tied with the little end, so we're going to adjust the little end to be long and uh, the big end to be short. I have it a little bit past my belly button, and uh, I'm going to tie the knot fairly close to my neck, so I don't need to pull it down that far, so I shouldn't go past my belt line. Alright, so let's have a closer look. So I'm going to start off with uh, dimpling the big end. We're going to take the little end cross over the front and it's going to come up through the back and top of the tie and cross back over. Now I want to make sure because uh, length is an issue and I'm using a very thick knot I probably won't have a lot left when I'm done this tie so I want to make sure this knot is super tight all along the way. So taking the little end now we made a triangle on this side I want to cross it over the underneath the front of my tie and do the same on the other side. Pull it going through the top, pulling it down and back across again. At this point I'm going to take the little end and cross over the front. This is the part that you're going to see at the bottom of your knot. Now I'm going to hold this part of the tie super tight and now I'm going to take the little end up through the top again and across. I want to tighten that up. I can't stress that enough, especially for the guys that are a little bit taller than I am. I'm not a tall guy, but if you're wearing a thick knot, then uh, you're going to run out of length pretty quickly. So, all right, now taking this. Uh, this little end we're going to keep now we're going to keep it loose we're going to bring it around the back and we're going to weave it through that loop so we're going to tighten that so I'm pulling on the back here and I'm pulling up where the little end is and now I can hold on to the front so it doesn't get covered up let me just tighten a little bit more. So with this little end, we're going to tuck it in behind and down. With the little end, we're going to make another loop right where we came. We're going to come up through the top and back down again keeping it loose we're going to cross over now this little end is going to fit through this end I promise doesn't look like I have a lot left but I know I can do it so when it comes time like this I'm just pinching onto the very end of my tie holding on to it I'm going to tighten by pulling the back end here of That's it. There's our Eldridge knot holding uh, the knot with one hand. You can pull down on the big end to tighten it. If you've got any of your uh, tie left, it's just going to tuck in behind the collar. There we go, there's the Eldridge knot. You can even do it with a big uh, thick knot like I've just done. Um, yeah, so smile, you've done the Eldridge knot. My name is Patrick Novotny, this is my YouTube channel. I'm covering every how to tie a necktie video of all different kinds that are out there. And subscribe if you want to. Thanks. <laughs>